Ladies and gentlemen, this is a short guide on how to solo hard mode Mechagon in order to get the aerial unit R21X mount. There are many guides out there with different cheese strategies, but this one is going to be for a paladin and we're going to do it the correct way. Which, by the way, is probably much harder, but nevertheless, here we go. First, you have to kill all three bosses while the aerial unit is on top of them, which makes them a little bit harder, but that should not be a problem whatsoever. A small tip that I can give you for after that, pick up a grease buff there all over the place. They give you a minor minor speed boost and maybe it's going to help a little bit. You're going to see that everything is very close at the end, so every little bit helps. Next, you want to go to the last boss and pick up the pylon at the north part, which is right from where you come in. You want to fight the boss in phase one as close as possible to the blue border. As once you kill him, you have to run up to the pylon as fast as possible and you want to minimize your run time. Once he's dead, use your steed. I would suggest picking up both talents for increased duration and extra charge and start running up the pylon using your shield and bubble to get through the blue beams as quickly as possible without getting teleported back. At the top, aim to land just behind the little patrolling robot and start channeling immediately. You do that by clicking on the pylon and if you select it as your target, you're going to see the bar slowly going down. The goal for that is to reach zero. Once the little robot circles back around you, wait for the blue beams to light up and then go forward, step backwards and start channeling again immediately. If you run backwards, you're going to run out of time because the boss is channeling at the same time and if he finishes the channel, you're gonna die, even if you immune it. Basically, you have to deal with the small robot total of three times and if you're lucky enough, you're going to finish channeling before the boss finishes the cast. As I mentioned, it has to be the north pylon because the distance to run to it is a little bit shorter compared to the south. I never managed to do it on the south pylon. And if you're unlucky, you can just die and repeat the boss over and over again until you get the north one. As you can see here, I finished the channel just before the cast goes off. At this point, you can just run down and kill the boss. There's a plenty of time to do that. And if you manage to get this far, this is probably the hardest part. After that, you proceed with the dungeon as normal. There's a pile of trash that you need to click on before you kill Kujo, which is two bosses from here. And if you did everything correctly, once you reach the very last boss, there's gonna be a big red button in the area once you enter. Just click it and kill the boss. At this point of time, you should be overpowered enough to nuke the boss down very quickly and not worry about any of the mechanics connected with this. You're gonna get stunned, don't worry about that, it's part of the fight. Just nuke the boss again once phase 2 starts and don't forget to kill the little bastard that jumps out at the end. If you're lucky, you should get the mount, it has relatively high drop chance, I got it on the first attempt, but even if that doesn't happen, 20% is actually quite high, so you should get it in just a few attempts. So that's how you do the hard mode Mechagon as a paladin. Let me know if you have any questions below and I'll see you guys in the next video. Now get out of here.